Depending on your operation, you may have some tubes attached to you when you return to the ward. For example, a drip or a catheter. You'll only have these for a short period of time and we'll encourage you to eat and drink and move around soon after your operation. If oxygen is needed after your operation, this is provided through either a mask on your face or a tube in your nose. There'll be a dressing over your wound and you may be wearing compression stockings to reduce the risks of blood clots forming. Pain after an operation can be expected and the pain relief you discussed beforehand will be in place. This could be self-administered medication through a drip or tablets, patches or injections given by the nurses. As well as the ward staff monitoring you very closely during the first 24 hours after your surgery, checking your blood pressure, pulse and temperature, they'll also ask if you're comfortable and if you're in any pain. It's very important that you do let us know if you're experiencing any severe pain between checks, that is, any pain that stops you moving about, so that we can make sure it's well controlled and you're always as comfortable as possible.